I just completed two days of synchronized trading for my most popular course, which is the Smartphone Video Storytelling Masterclass. And some of the feedback that I got from the from this synchronized online training was really, really encouraging because this is the first time I am actually converting the course from a face-to-face -to, -face to a synchronized version. We also have a, a synchronized version which is more of a self-paced learning. Um, but today is the first time that we have managed to deliver this synchronized session. So the difference between the synchronized and the asynchronized trading is that they are both delivered online. However, what's different is that the synchronized one, actually it's real time and you get immediate feedback with the facilitator. Whereas the asynchronized one, it's more of a self-paced, self-learned mode of learning. So one of the best thing with the a, with the synchronized version is the ability to customize. That's number one. And the other thing is the ability to structure it in such a way that it doesn't bring about too much fatigue for the participant having to stare at the screen for a full six seven hours so some of the things that i did was number one you know i i introduced frequent shorter breaks for us for the participant as well as for myself to kind of stretch and to look out the windows and to just get our eyes off the screen the other thing that i do is i use the breakout room function in zoom that allows me to break people up into small groups so it's just like in a face-to-face -face training whereby you huddle in groups. In the Zoom, you actually huddle in small groups and the group, the group will not be able to know what the other groups are discussing. So you have that ability to do that, which is very good because it allows for people to, to participate and to interact with one another. And sometimes arguably the learning from each other during the course it's probably one of the reaches that you can get right and of course the other aspect of it is really the personalization and what i like about this this program done in a synchronized manner it's the ability to, to personalize as well as the ability to give immediate feedback in terms of what they're doing and how they're doing it so as an example, one part of it, it's really me showing how to put together footage of videos that you have done, how to stitch them together to, and to tell a story. And after they see me doing it, the participants are able to actually do it on their own. And I'm able to kind of supervise each and every one of them, which is fantastic, right? So what are some tips or strategies that you have when it comes to conducting whether it's a synchronized or asynchronized training. What are some tips and strategies you have? Share with me, share with my network. I'm sure we can all benefit from it since we're in lockdown mode right now.